Good morning and welcome to All About The Cakes. So here we are inside the door into the workroom and I am Lisa. This is where the magic happens, where we discuss, we create, we design, we make your perfect wedding cake. I'm open to any suggestions, re flavours. Um, at the moment, I have a comprehensive list of 18 flavours, but I've been sending out sample boxes um, to anybody that likes cake to try and reduce that number. So for your tasting, instead of asking you to choose six from that list, I'm just going to give you eight cakes to taste. If there's anything on there that you don't want or there's something specifically you want to try, I'll make it for you and you can try it on the day. I believe in making the cake taste as you need it to taste, hence the name All About The Cakes. It's important to me that your cake tastes as you imagined it would do and all your guests absolutely love it. When it's cut, it looks lovely. So the colours don't look bland. There, um, there's a nice mix with the filling and the colour of the sponge. So with the chocolate cake, instead of putting a chocolate fudge buttercream in there, we could put a white chocolate fudge buttercream in there or we could put white chocolate ganache. So when your cake is cut, you've got that brown, white, brown, white, rather than just brown. It looks more appealing and people want to eat it. Um, also, it's really important to me what your cake looks like on the outside. So that when you first see your cake, you've got that amazing wow factor, not just, oh, it's another wedding cake and that your wedding cake contributes to your wedding. So you've got, um, it encompasses the colours, the moods. It says a little bit about you, which is where cakes with two-sided parts actually come in. So something like this. So for those of you that know your Disney, the front of this is actually designed around Beauty and the Beast. So you've got the frills at the bottom of um, the princess skirts. Then you've got the chandeliers from the ballroom. And then you've got just flowers from her posy. We turn it round. Oh, and white roses. White roses were from the film um, and not from the um, Disney. And then we come round the back. So we've got the Lion King. This, this cake would have been my dream cake when we got married. Um, the, the bottom part, the Lion King, that came out the year my first daughter was born. The middle is Mickey and Minnie, so you've got to have those on a Disney cake. And then you've got Beauty and the Beast. Then we have Stitch, now he's my favourite, so he's got to be on there somewhere. And at the top, we've got the castle. The berries from the flowers at the front were designed so that they look like the fireworks on the top of the castle at the beginning of any of the films or at the end of any Disney day. So this just says a little bit about you with nobody realising from the front that there's a little secret at the back. If you want to be a little bit cheeky, we've got this. It actually says, eat, drink, we are married. And as you can see, it's displayed on a martini glass. Um, that just says, yeah, this is us. Um, you can bring in, you can incorporate bits of your wedding with that. The original cake we made, that was just about saying you can have a stunning cake in one colour. You don't have to add lots of different bits, but if you wanted to make this yours, we just change the colour of the ribbon bring in your bridesmaids colours. Um, so we've, that's quite a popular cake. This one is just classic. I'm all about making your cake for you. I don't believe that you should pay for cake that you're not going to eat. So if you have got 50 guests coming and you want a cake that makes a statement, 
the couple that actually had this cake had um, 50 guests coming and um, they wanted a cake that looked good in their photos that the guests walked in and thought wow that's good noticed it um, so the top tier was a dummy and half of each tier was a dummy those tiers are seven inches tall uh, so they fed plenty of their guests so there are ways of making your cake look amazing without you wasting money i don't believe you should pay for something that's going to go in the bin um, alternatively if you like cake have it all as cake it will freeze i make all your cakes the same week um, as your wedding um, so yeah if you want to chat further uh, tell me about you tell me about your cake tell me what you want to do and we can work this out together it's about a partnership with us both um, in these times as they are at the moment it's not easy um, we're all feeling a little bit you know hemmed in locked in um, I've been keeping busy making cupcakes um, saying thank you to key workers stuff like that um, but it's giving you time to refine what you want you know it gives us all a bit of time to sort stuff ready for your wedding so instead of meeting we can do a video chat and I'm open to using um, anything that's suitable for you if you want to call me and have a chat um, I will give you my details contact me on zoom during the wedding fair um, and we can jot down a couple of bits we can get together later go through a few bits I'll send you out some samples in the post uh, and then we can talk about it okay look forward to hearing from you because I love talking about weddings <laughs>